The other thing was probably one of the biggest comments that we got from customers when we reached out to customers and also manufacturers of, of the of the tray mat material area was we needed to address the shape of the of the tray. The GP1 has always had a very unique shape to its bottom tray. It has, has a low tray. It was one of the first skis to have a really low tray. And to create the tray to be as low as possible, there were some pretty big um, compromises in the shape of the tray. Some people it really worked well for them and they liked it. Other people didn't. The majority of people did not like it. Um, the problem is if you had a shoe size over seven, you just, you, your feet didn't fit in the tray properly. You would have to then build the tray up to create, try to create a flatter tray, which then changed the shape of the tray anyways. So one of, that was probably the, one of the biggest pushbacks from people was, was on the tray. So we took a lot of time addressing that and trying to create a solution that was gonna work for everybody. Keeping the tray low, as low as we could in the front, so we didn't really change the front of the tray much. Um, we actually maintained, were able to maintain that, that low point in the front of the tray and then transitioned it as it went back to keep it as low as possible for, um, and keep it low and flat so that everyone enjoys it. Um, at that same time when we were designing that, we found that we were able to widen the tray also. So the tray itself is completely different. The tray is, is low in the front, has a really nice smooth transition to the back, and then it is wider. Um, the way it rolls off the back of the tray is much smoother, so it's much easier to get into the tray um, on starts. And it's shaped in a way that you, you definitely know where the back of the ski is, so you're not stepping off the back of the ski. It's, it's wider, it's lower. Um, adding that extra width to it also really helped with, with the handling on the boat also. Um, having that extra width allows the boat to, to set into the corners and a little bit easier. It helped a lot with, with the boat um, being able to sweep at high speeds also. Um, and that's, that area was, there was a lot of feedback from customers on that. And so we really tried to take a good hard look at that and pay attention to what people were asking, what they were liking. We looked at a lot of how people were modifying their existing tray the, from the old from the old design to get it to get it right for them. The feedback on it has been a hundred percent. Everybody really seems to like it.